So what we wanted to do was set up an online educational platform. And as we were going through the process of this, um, my good friend, um, home is threatened to be foreclosed on. And so what I wanted to do to, to help my friend is to basically, since we're a non for profit, um, run a few campaigns to see if we could possibly fundraise to save the house. But my friend is stuck in the mindset of somebody giving um, without the work. And I'm sorry, if you want to be an entrepreneur, you got to get out of the mindset of not wanting to put energy, your energy, your soul into something and then expect to be able to get something out of it. It just doesn't work. It's not going to work. It's two different paradigms. It's the mindset of a of a servant, a slave, a worker, um, a welfare recipient. Uh, and I'm not putting down welfare recipients because there is a time when I actually had to use welfare. But I used the welfare. I didn't make it a lifestyle. If And you say, well, what do you mean by that? Well... Um, what I mean is that it was a stepping stone. It was an opportunity for me to uh, take the government assistance and use it to um, establish myself, not to create a lifelong relationship of of, of wanting something for nothing. And I suggest that, you know, everybody has that. It's, not, it's nothing wrong with using government assistance, but use it to, to, to push yourself up. Don't, don't use it to um, have a lifestyle of not living to your potential. I guess I could put it like that. Um, I mean, corporations, they get, you know, massive, uh, I guess, stimulus checks and things like that, but when they get their check, you're going to see a new building. You're going to see some new equipment. You're going to see um, you're going to see the evidence of 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 that giving um, to make the company better. And I guess that's what I'm saying is that we have to get to the place where we live to our fullest potential. And if you have to use government assistance to do that. Um, use it, but don't make it a culture, you know, um, or this entitlement, which we probably do have entitlement. So I'm not saying that, well, if you get the entitlement, when you get the entitlement, use it to sow into yourself. Sow into yourself. Plant, plant seeds in your field so that you can live to your fullest potential. Um, no one knows like um, the African Americans what it's like to be suppressed at the level that we've been suppressed. So I'm not saying you know that um, we don't need help. What I am saying is that take the help and use the help to propel yourself to your next level. This is Sherry Brown Pittman. I'm with Sankofa Reform of Research. We provide educational online platforms. Thank you.